64 acres of summertime fun located on a Lake Erie Peninsula halfway between Cleveland and Toledo. Cedar Point's White Sand Beach, still a major attraction, was the first drawing card that brought visitors to Cedar Point more than 120 summers ago. The first bathhouse was built on the shore in 1870. In 1888, an enormous two-story grand pavilion was built near the beach. The park boasted that it provided shelter and shade for 10,000 people. Cedar Point's first roller coaster was built near the pavilion in 1892. Water swings and slides entertain bathers. The park grew slowly until the late 1890s when an enterprising businessman, George Beckling, turned it into a major resort that came to be known as the queen of American watering places. A massive coliseum hosted musical performances and some of the first motion pictures seen in Ohio. Pioneer aviator Glenn Curtis completed the longest overwater flight of his day at Cedar Point in 1910. The 1890s through the 1920s were the old Cedar Point's glory years. this time, colorful steamships brought most of Cedar Point's guests to the park. Visitors who arrived in Sandusky by excursion train took one of the gigantic ferries that crossed the portion of the bay between the downtown docks and the Cedar Point Pier. Vacationers also began arriving by automobile after the road connecting Cedar Point to the mainland was built in 1914. Hundreds of college students were hired to staff the resort. Among them was Newt Rockley, future Notre Dame football coach, who perfected the forward pass while working as a lifeguard at Cedar Point during the summer of 1913. The 30s and 40s are memorable primarily for the musical talent that played at dances in the Coliseum Ballroom. Some of the performances were broadcast nationally on the NBC radio network. The roster included such musical stars as Woody Herman, Les Brown, Duke Ellington, Guy Lombardo, Harry James, Count Basie, and Skitch Henderson. In the late 1950s, Cedar Point was slated to be turned into a housing development. However, because of the public outcry over those plans, the developers decided there was enough interest to keep it open as an amusement park. So construction began on the modern Cedar Point. The owners studied the new theme park concepts being developed in California and combined some of those ideas with Cedar Point's long tradition of family entertainment. The result was a formula that's been winning millions of fans for more than 30 years.
Today, Cedar Point is one of the most popular vacation destinations in the United States. Guests come from all over the country and even many foreign nations to sample its unequaled combination of rides and attractions. Cedar Point has more rides than anywhere else in the country and the biggest roller coaster collection in the world. The Magnum XL200 is inescapable. Even before you reach Cedar Point, it looms on the skyline. This roller coaster is the champ. The Magnum has been honored by the Guinness Book of World Records as having the longest, steepest, fastest drop. A 205 foot tall hill dropping you more than 194 feet at a 60 degree angle, generating speeds of 72 miles an hour. Lurking near the lagoons lies a unique thriller, Mantis. This roller coaster sends riders down a 145-foot tall hill while standing up. Mantis's twisted track flips those brave enough to stand up to this challenge upside down four times, including a monstrous vertical loop over water. For high-tech thrills, riders will literally kick the sky on Raptor. This innovative roller coaster will fly you into a new dimension of fun and excitement. Soaring and twisting through the air, Raptor carries its prey in ski lift like chairs through six inversions. The Mean Streak is one of the tallest and fastest wooden roller coasters in the world. It climbs 160 feet toward the sky, drops its riders over 12 hills at speeds up to 65 miles per hour, and twists and winds its way for more than a mile through its awesome structure nine times. Among our other coasters is the Iron Dragon suspended roller coaster. The swinging motion and the fog surrounding the final tangle of track enhance the excitement of this unique ride. Racing adds to the coaster excitement of the Gemini. True to its name, the Gemini has twin trains that compete as they speed along its wooden hills. The Gemini is Cedar Point's most popular ride, with millions of guests speeding down its 125-foot-tall first hill at 60 miles an hour every year. The granddaddy of Cedar Point's roller coasters is the Blue Streak. Built in 1964, this traditional wooden coaster may not be as big as some of Cedar Point's others, but its fast, hilly ride still has a lot of fans. These roller coasters are great, but that's not the end of the Cedar Point coaster collection. Disaster transport takes you on a roller coaster ride through a deep, dark outer space adventure. Cedar Point guests turn head over heels for the corkscrew. This thriller was the first coaster in the world to turn riders upside down three times.
The Cedar Creek Mine Ride takes you on a trip that simulates an out-of-control mine train. The Wildcats' tight turns and steep drops don't even give you time to be scared. And the six mile per hour Junior Gemini is a training coaster for kids too young to take advantage of the real thing. But the thrills don't end on Cedar Point's roller coasters. On Power Tower, you can choose which way you'd rather be terrified. Blasted 240 feet into the air, or rocketed to the ground from 24 stories high, both at 50 miles an hour. Now that's a thrill ride. If spinning around upside down is what you're looking for, the witch's wheel is the place to go. This ride starts off innocently enough, but before long, the sky and ground run together in a blur as the wheel rises and turns you over and over again. Riding is the most popular pastime at Cedar Point. With more than 50 rides to choose from, you're sure to find one that spins, twists, or swings you to your heart's delight. On a hot day, Cedar Point's water rides are guaranteed to cool you off. Float down a whitewater river and under a waterfall at Thunder Canyon. No one stays dry on Snake River Falls. Following an 80-foot drop, the boat creates a wall of water that soaks riders and spectators alike. Plunge down a 45-foot tall torrent of water on Whitewater Landing. If you like your rides a little slower, drier, and closer to the ground, there are plenty to choose from. Delightful band organ music is the tip-off to our antique carousel. The Midway Carousel is an outstanding example of the work of Daniel Mueller, who's considered one of the greatest woodcarvers of all time. The Denzel Kittyland Carousel features an exceptional figure, an armored horse which was depicted on a U.S. postage stamp. Besides horses, the Kittyland Carousel also carries a lion, tiger, ostriches, bears, and rabbits. The Cedar Downs Racing Derby is a unique, fast version of a carousel. It gives a new race every time, with riders competing as their horses jockey for position during the ride. The Cedar Point and Lake Erie Railroad recreates the bygone era of steam-powered railroad locomotives. The trains carry park guests between the main midway and frontier town, and each locomotive has its own name. You can experience another type of old-fashioned transportation on paddle wheel excursions. These boats take you and your fellow passengers on an amusing voyage to Ohio's past. For young people, Cedar Point has a whole world of kid-sized fun. Kiddie rides such as the Junior Gemini roller coaster and Sir Rub-a-Dub's Tubs, a miniature water ride, were specially designed to delight children. Farm animals wait to be met at our early petting farm on the Frontier Trail. Live musical entertainment sparkles on the stages of Cedar Point's theaters. There's singing and dancing to satisfy everyone's musical tastes. The Cedar Point Cinema offers an overwhelming experience with its enormous screen half the size of a football field. The 66-foot by 88-foot screen and six-track stereo sound really make you feel a part of the breathtaking IMAX movies shown in the cinema. A trip down the frontier trail is like a trip through time. As you move down the trail sheltered in the woods, the 20th century slips away, 
and you enter a settlement where artisans and craftspeople demonstrate skills our ancestors needed to survive. Right next door to all the fun and excitement of Cedar Point is Challenge Park and Soak City. Challenge Park offers an exciting collection of activities. Challenge Golf features two unusual 18-hole miniature golf courses filled with surprises. Grand Prix Raceway offers speedy go-kart action for prospective race car drivers. And Ripcord is a spectacular adventure that will hoist you up 15 stories, then launch you on a heart-pounding flight, swooping you through the air like a bird. Soak City is the coolest spot around, with water slides from mild to wild. A relaxing inner tube river, and Renegade River with waterfalls and geysers. Kids even have two play areas just for them. With so much to see and do at Cedar Point, it's hard to pack it all into one day. But if you plan to take a couple of days to enjoy the park, it's easy to stay close to all the fun. Camper Village has sites for RVs and trailers in a lovely wooded setting. Boaters can take advantage of our full-service marina, which has almost 200 guest slips available on a daily basis. Sandcastle Suites has a spectacular location at the very tip of the Cedar Point Peninsula. The Hotel Breakers is a lovely turn-of-the-century building filled with old-fashioned charm. A new wing offers two-room suites with patios and balconies. Cedar Point is a magical place where summertime dreams come true for everyone. From breathtaking rides to sparkling musical entertainment to splashing water rides, Cedar Point provides the best in summertime fun. Looking for a good time? Get to the point. Cedar Point.